Jen, thank you so much for joining us here on Idaho Today. April and I are so excited. I know. Yeah, okay. So you are Christmas. in the middle. I know Christmas, right? <laughs> you were in the middle of production on a great American family holiday movie. It's called Stay for Christmas. So give us a little background on this. So this is a super fun Christmas classic already off the top. It's called Be and Be Merry, and I play a character named Tracy Wise. She is a travel blogger and she gets invited to a bed and breakfast that's struggling, of course, in Vermont. Um, and I meet the owner, played by the amazing Jesse Hutch, and his name is Graham in the story. And uh, I find out that I'm actually, I've been hired to write an article for their main competitor that's literally threatening their family business. So, you know, makes me a little uncomfortable. He doesn't know about it, of course. Uh, and of course he finds out. And so you'll have to tune in to see how it turns out. But it's basically, um, you know, the classic girl from the city goes to a small town and helps the boy rescue his family business. So it's really cute. And and be merry. It airs on Sunday, December 4th on Great American Family. Okay, so December 4th, mark your calendar. It's a perfect holiday yeah. movie, right? Absolutely. I, I, <laughs> I absolutely cannot wait. Uh, I live for the holiday season in the movies, that, especially Great American Family. Um, so many people, so many of your fans know you from Hallmark Channel and your, your, all of your films from there. What, what was the impetus and what made you jump from Hallmark to Great American Family? And, and you're more than just an actress. You're an executive producer now. Yes, I am. I'm an executive producer, a mom of four, and I also <laughs> run a nonprofit uh, fundraising company called Christmas Is Not Canceled. So it's Christmas oh, at my house all the time. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's Christmas at my house all the time. But, um, you know, I love Hallmark. I am so glad that I got so much of my career going there. Mm -hmm. um, but as you all know, you know, Bill Abbott was the CEO of Hallmark. And I think there's something to be said for loyalty. And especially in the entertainment business, you know, you don't find a lot of that. And Bill has always championed my career. Um, and just he's just been such an honorable person from top to bottom. And I was so delighted that he wanted me on his new network. So it was a pretty much a no brainer for me. And now we have all of our friends, you know, except for Lacey, but we have Candace, <laughs> Pure, Danica, McKellar, but it's fun because all of us are friends, you know, all the actors from all the Christmas movies and we really celebrate each other. All right, so you had mentioned all of these things that you do in addition to being an EP as well and an actress and producing and being a part of this movie. Um, you're also a singer as well, which I have to ask, do you have any holiday traditions that you follow through with, like perhaps caroling? You know, I grew up, my mom, name a tradition, my mo mother my mother did it. Um, and so we had caroling parties growing up. I haven't caroled in a really long time, but maybe that's a thing we should bring back in 2022. <laughs> okay, all right, I a little inspiration that. there then too. Yeah. You, you mentioned um, your nonprofit. Is it a nonprofit? Uh, Christmas is not canceled. I know you do a podcast uh, that that is about fostering, which is close, you know, is a cause near and dear to your heart. And, and if yeah. I understand correctly, two of your children are foster children, and you are mother of four. You're busy, busy. Yeah. So tell tell us a little True. bit about your nonprofits and and your in your charities that you're involved in. So two of my children, yeah, they're adopted from foster care. So I run a company called Christmas is Not Canceled, like I said, and it's not a nonprofit. What we do is we are really great at marketing and we make fundraising fun so that nonprofits that we love and support can focus on what they do best because um, my business partner was in charge of PR and marketing for a national nonprofit for years. I've been a celebrity ambassador for years for multiple charities. And what you find internally with charities is, you know, they don't like fundraising. It's really hard and it takes a lot of energy. And so we take that off their plates. We partner every single fall with Toys for Tots and Child Help. Um, and we, this year we have a goal to give 25,000 toys. Um, last year we gave a little over 20,000 toys to Toys for Tots and Child Help. Um, so it goes to children all over the nation and how our company works, it's so fun. If you go to christmasisnotcanceled.com and you buy a gift on our site, like instead of going to Target, you buy a gift on our site, we give that gift to the charity and then we give you 25 entries into every single weekly drawing, including a grand prize. And like, for example, this year, people win everything they would need to experience that perfect great American family Christmas. So like the Balsam Hill Christmas tree, the ornaments, the wreath, the, de the decor, the Christmas dinner, but they can also go to Hollywood and have dinner with me, Lacey Chabert, oh, wow. Paul Green, yeah. and Andrew Walker. So some of your favorite 
Christmas movie stars, we all get involved and really rally behind the cause. So we have a lot of fun giving back and it's just been awesome. Okay, so in addition to everything that you're doing, you're also giving back and you're also offering the people an opportunity to put really a bow on top of their holiday experience. That's incredible, <laughs> Jen. Okay, so remind everybody really quick, how do we watch Stay for Christmas? So they can watch, well, and now it's called B&B &B Mary. Isn't that a more fun oh, name? So the name I, changed, B&B I, I, B &B Mary. I like that. The names always change, but this one sticks. So it's called B&B &B Mary now. So mark your calendar uh, for December the 4th. That's a Sunday. And I believe it should be on at 8 p.m. on Great American Family. And if you don't have Great American Family, there's an app called Friendly TV where you can watch it there. Wonderful. And then really quick, how do we follow you on social? Because you are a busy woman. You're so sweet. It's Jen, J-E-N underscore Lily, L-I-L-L-E-Y. And you can also follow my amazing co-star, Jessie Hutch, at Jessie, J-E-S-S-E underscore Hutch, H-U-T-C-H. Wonderful, Jen. Thank you so Thank much. You. We greatly appreciate you taking the time awesome. to chat with us. Appreciate you guys. Thank you. Thank Bye -bye. you.